Welcome back to Terra Nil. My name is Nilaus, and this is the second episode of our, well, let's call it a let's try of our of our series here. Uh, thank you very much for your support on the first episode. It's always very nice to see that when people are enjoying the content. And uh, I will be jumping into the next, which will now is going to be a tropical zone. It's going to be an island. So a desolate island is where we want to go. Climate threshold achieved. There are 11 of those. There are six animals and then there are four biomes. I wonder what that is. Oh. Okay, so, oh, that's oh, that's probably like a seed. Okay, let's jump on into that one. Two. All right, here we are, tropical. <clears throat> Rebuilding an island's ecosystem is a unique challenge. Restoring life to the oceans is your number one priority. Using toxin scrubbers to clean the seawater. Fewer river networks means you'll need to use monorail infrastructure here. You'll need to begin by cleaning the surrounding oceans and reintroducing plant life. Toxin scrubbers are integral as they cleanse both land and sea. Both greenery and clean oceans contribute towards your goal. Climate manipulation is possible from the outset. Excellent. Here, animals, nothing there, index, and then go out. All right, so what do we have? We have an island. And, yep, that's surrounding all the way around. We got 1,000 to land on here, and then we just need to figure out. Uh, I think that we'll have... This seems like a good place to start up with some water supply from... Boop. Let's build a water supply. Hmm. I was hoping I could actually build it a little bit higher up. Oh, well, not really. We can also just build it over here, I guess. Let's build something and also take it over here. There we go. I want to get these sorted immediately so we get get some some nice uh, greenery. All right. So the first thing is getting a lot of this greenery up. And we need one more windmill and then we get something new. Let's build that over here and see what we get. What is that? That is a mineralizer. Okay. So that needs... That's kind of the same as the one we had the calcifier last time. So we can build that and then make some sea area thing out here. For example, out in the deep ocean. All right. And we need to unlock... 500 ocean tiles so looks like we need to focus a little bit on ocean tiles so let's plop down some things here to get this and i also want to just go out here into this realm so we're actually getting making a positive we're getting positive parts here plus 26 because we are reclaiming some of the water and that actually counts as a positive thing and then we can also go over here oh that's a minus so that's cost a lot here and this one will just be all right so we are starting to spread out let's get some power here let's try one of these calcification thing oh no mineralizer here to get a little bit there and we want to get all of this area here also farmed out there we go and this part as well Right, so now we have a good location here. Let's uh, get some more. We're just uh, basically getting as much as we can of this area here. And let's see. That's probably as good as we can get it here. Look at that. Great. And we just try to get as much as possible here. Um, that's also fine, I guess. Getting that one done. We're paying a little bit of attention to this uh, here is another location that I think I want to get a water supply up here so I'm going to need to get a calcification and then a water pump there we go so we get water pumps all the way around and we're also going to need to get let's build that here and build another one as far over on this side as possible toxin scrubbers and that should be a good location for That's probably as good as we can make it. Let me a little bit over here, but we'll get that when we have it. Let's also have a look at this part. I forgot to check this. So what we have here is uh, there's one that's a bit tricky. We now have both temperature and humidity. So before we go temperature up, we have to get moisture up to 50%. That's the only one that has a less than here. Everyone else has a greater than. So as soon as we... We need to make, in order for us to get everything, we must get the moss on green, on rock faces here. 
And that means we need to focus on terraforming. What do we have? We have, uh, okay, we get one when we get the next tier. So a cloud seeder, that would be, oh, oh wow, that's a lot of cloud seeding we get here. There we go. That's a, a good improvement. Uh, still nothing because most of them are also increased, uh, need some temperature as well. But we want to get up to above 50 so we can get the moss on. But let's get that sorted first. That should be plus 9. <laughs> That's exactly not what we want. Plus 9 is exactly not enough. Uh, over here. Oh, plus 10. Great. That's what we need. Then we get to 50 and we get the moss on rock faces. Look, all the way around here, we now get moss and... Well, I guess that's a little bit more, up to 60. Great, so we'll uh, we'll be happy with this for now. And that means we can, now we can increase temperature and we can increase moisture as much as we like. But first, we're going to go back uh, to this part. We are going to have to build some of these things out here to build some places for power. Mm, I wonder if how we... Hmm, like that. And... Yeah. Just trying to, to get all of this area just as filled up as possible. Oh, we got this one. A sandbank. A sandbank is uh, is an interesting concept because we can build it. Uh, okay, so not You can build it out here and then use it for, for example, let's try it. For, uh, for effort or for show. Like that. Oh, we're really running down here. Let's, uh, let's focus a little bit on our <laughs> supply. Yeah, instead, there we go. That's 106. There. Let's get that one. We need to make sure that we do not run out. And here as well. That's a really good one. Look at that. We're we're making good progress. And that looks very much like one that goes this way. Perfect. All right, we're good on money again. And then we can make a sandbank. Uh, okay and then I think I can build this on top of the sandbank which will then clean some of the ocean around here good that actually also helps and then we need a mineralizer here in order to get this area cleaned out I guess I'll do this I'll get a good nice chunk here 91% it's so close that one as well See, I don't get it until I build here. There. Do we get it? 99%? It's so close. It's so close. Uh, where could we build something? We could build something like this and get more of the ocean covered. There we go. All right. So that was the first part. The next step is increasing biodiversity. Restore beaches, mangroves, and tropical rainforest. You'll need to use the monorail network to transport coral polyps, polyps to the sea that's not what we want to do now but uh, we'll get a little bit so here we have a new thing ding 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 what is that construct three combustors and reclaim 50 wetlands okay and we have the hydroponium so that can do this part uh, where do we have a combustor we do not have a combustor so I guess oh we have a combustor here okay what does the combustor do Burn surrounding vegetation to increase atmospheric temperature. Yeah. Um, we need that. But the question is... It's increasing temperature. Yes. Okay, we want to increase temperature. Yep. Yeah. Um, but we also want to get some wetlands. So I think we continue a little bit more on this part here. Because we do need... Some kind of way to get all of this in here. Oops. There. Yeah. There. I'm just trying to really, this time around, really cover as much as possible here. There. So that's running down, and that means we need to make sure that we have more of this. 111. That's a nice amount. And, oh, we got, uh, what did that? Oh, we got more humidity come up here. Okay, interesting. And thunderstorms start only at 99. <laughs> and 80% we get water lilies. Okay. That's a little bit high. Uh, now the temperature is really the next part. Now, 
I guess we need to make these combustors. They probably won't do as much. Uh, that's going to be two degrees. Okay. Let's see where we can burn things. Oh, eight degrees. We'll take it. Kind of sad that it happens, but I, I guess they'll kind of recover when we get more oxygen. That's a good one. Eight degrees more. We got migratory birds returned. Perfectly. Perfect. And we are now up to 18. Jellyfish. Maybe undergrowth. Dragonflies. Okay, there's a lot of cool things that we can get. We'll get one more of those because that triggers the next part. Uh, this is... The best thing we can get is eight, I guess. So we'll just do this one. Look at that. Jellyfish and crabs populate beaches. I don't have beaches, but that's a that's a start. All right, we've got more. And we are working our way towards this. So now that's more temperature. This one's more rain. Actually, 35 is the highest we want to go for temperature, or at least the highest we need to go for temperature. Uh, so we have unlocked a new one here. What is that? That is a... A litarium captures sand and forms beaches that's pretty good but it needs to be green before it can go there okay so we'll need to basically just get everything else done first there that's gonna get some ocean and when we do this when we clean the ocean it actually helps us this only cost two because we get a lot of the ocean converted that gives us uh, money uh, or not money or whatever it's called here 17 there get out there so this part needs to be made green as well oh here is another place that needs to be uh, taken and that one and over here as well I guess yeah we're burning through a lot of materials here but uh, I think we can get more in if we go 55 this is making money, or I keep calling money, but it's not. Like that. All right, 57, and soon we can't get much more here. Uh, let's get a horizontal line, that one. That's perfect. And one more, which will be like this. There, so that's basically the entire build and that's also kind of all we can do all right great we could get a little bit more here but um, uh, let's see let's actually do that i want to get it out here boom there yeah build the sandbank there and then build this on top of the sandbank that is a net positive thing so i i like that and Okay, there's no other places. Great. So we are really settling in pretty well here. Now, let's have a look at what it is. Construct one more cloud seeder. Um, okay, let's get one more cloud seeder, I guess. Plus nine is a good one. What about here? Plus 14. Go. That's the ivy under... Ivy evergrowth. Perfect. And how much more? We are 75, 80, and 99. Uh, there we go. We got this one unlocked. That is, oh, the shade cloth pillar. That is for making tropical rainforest. So now we have the hydro something EM um, here. Uh, this is going to be the mangrove forest for sure. That one is mangrove. This is the mangrove here. It's vines grow. Okay, so we actually got a little bit more health and a little bit more humidity from this one. Oh, ideal. Sweet, 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 sweet. Look at that. And we're 85. That works. Okay, let's make this into mangrove. Awesome. Still need more mangrove? That's a lot of extra mangrove we need. And we get this one completed. Perfect. What is this? This is a salinator. Uh, increase the salinity of the surrounding area, allowing mangroves to rush, rush, rush. Okay. Oh, look at that. 74, 85. We'll go up there. Oh, that just makes it even better. Things. Okay. Yeah. Now that is mangroves are done. And this is our mangrove corner. 
Great. So let's look at the beaches. I kind of think I need to repopulate this again. Getting the... Getting this back online. There. Yes, I do. There. And also this one. There you go. So they're now back online. Good. And now we need to look at the beaches. So that's over it a... The Tarium. That's the one. Uh, that's going to be a nice beach here. Yes. This is our beach resort area. There you go. That's a little bit. Let's get that one converted. How are we doing here? 82%? Um, more beach. That's a little bit expensive. But that one can also just get a little bit more. Uh, you? Yeah, get more more beach beachfront there. That is great. We're almost done. And let's get this one. Are we done? Nope, not done yet. Uh, we need to make sure that they actually over not overlap, but uh, merge together. There might be some kind of creature that wants them to be near. Ooh, what did we get? We got the monorail. All right. So now we need to work on the tropical forest and the coral reef. The tropical forest needs high ground to set these uh, shade cloth pillars. And then the monorail is kind of the last and most difficult one. We have to address the... Ooh, we, don't, we definitely need coconut palms and uh, dragonflies as well. So we need more temperature. And um, that is probably going to be built by torching... This is pretty damn cool idea, this part. There. And then you build... Yeah. And then the area in here gets converted into tropical forest. I like that. Uh, and we can then build another one, which will then encapsulate even more area. Like this. Sweet. Ideal 15 as well. And then see if we can get something over here. Uh, is prolific and can grow on land at any height? Yes. But we just, for some reason, need to do it this way. So, for example, I can also build it over here. And then it will still work on the slope below. That's too far away. There. Now, the next part I want to do is we need to get more heat. We're not getting more heat like this. Uh, so, we're going to get find a way to get more heat. And that's going to be a burner. And that burner could be made hmm that's six degrees uh where do we have that one could be a thing too close to another ah okay hmm we need to make sure that we get some some of this uh there That's connected. And then... Ooh, look at that. That's a massive amount of extra. We're just getting a little bit more here and a little bit more. But I think we need to up it by uh, by getting more here. Um, where did we have that location? There are these locations. There. That's a good one. And now I can torch this area in here. Nine degrees. Let's get this to 38. Mm, I'm going to need a little bit more. There. And now I can torch it. 10 degrees. Perfect. That gets us to 40. That's everything. There we go. Except for the thunderstorms. So in order for us to get thunderstorms, we need to get more cloud seeding. Um, let's have a look. This is a great place to do cloud seeding. Boom. And we get thunderstorms rolling. Sweet. Alright, let's also re-establish this part so we can re-establish our forest here hmm okay oops well that's a good progress now the only thing we don't have is the coral reef and the reason we don't have the coral reef is because we don't have the monorails so let's figure out how the monorails work they're really weird um so you build a monorail here and then you can't really do anything else until you build the next monorail so for example there they are now connected and then you can click on it and then you can move and Move a location from somewhere in the network to somewhere else in the network. Uh, the thing is, like, 
this is obviously too far away from that one. Well, not obviously, which means I need to build some of these interject uh, in between here, and then get that connected. So, and then I need to get go back here and trying to sort of match. That's going to be connected. And then hopefully we can connect it over here. Yes, indeed. All right, so I just want to make a long monorail because everything needs to also, when we start cleaning up our location, we need to get out on the monorail as well. So we might as well be trying to get these monorail connections. See, that's too far, but this is close enough. Okay, so... Um, Use the monorail to move one ability, or uh, one thing. So we basically need to just test something and then uh, say, uh, what if we, oh no, no, I'm, I'm gonna get a little bit further over here. That one, here, and then the monorail goes up to that location and it goes over to this location, brilliant. And we can, so all of this is now connected on one monorail location and that means if I wanted to move something for example uh, I click on this then I can click something inside you where do I want to get it no uh, you click on this click on that where do we want to build it I don't know uh, let's build it over here it costs something to move but that doesn't matter but that is uh, the reason why I needed to do it was because now I got the last one the coral lab it is not the ideal temperature for the coral lab but I don't think that matters, but the idea is now I will build this part and then I can take from the monorail, I can pick this up and I can throw it into the, the ocean. And splash. So that seeds some corals. I can upgrade this one because we don't need these anymore. So might as well just do it. And then I click on the here and then uh, what about out there? 45, that's a good location. That's kind of why we wanted to build it out there, just to make sure that we have location. Look at that beautiful coral reef here. Let's get something else. This one is... No, that's a hydroponium, so that's not working. This one we can do, but it would require us to have like that. That's brilliant. So you are going to be selecting here, and then I'm going to drop it in that location. We're also going to make some corals over on this side. Uh, so it's just a matter of finding more of these hydroponium things that we can convert. Uh, I'm going to build that here. And then get... That's good. And then here's another location. And then where's the other locations? That's a location. So we'll get a location in between here. Perfect. Boom. And this will need to go over there. So now I can take another. This is a little bit too far away. Oh, that's too far. Oh, it's connected. It's connected over to that one. Brilliant. Now I can use you. And maybe also... You can pick this up and then throw it into the ocean like that. That's a good place to get some corals. Oh, look at the jellyfish. They're back. And this cannot pick up here. This is actually a little bit problematic. Oh, there. Oh, look at that. We got all of these locations. Monorails can be utilized for recycling. So connect your airship to the monorail network. It reintroduce marine and terrestrial animals to help maintain the ecosystem when you leave. Sounds good. Animals, don't know anything about that. Index and go. So now we need to both clean up and uh, build our animal observatory. Let's build the animal observatory right to here. There we go. And then we have a recycler station and we oh, we need to get our ship as well. Let's, uh, let's build it here. And let's realize that this... Oh, no, this is not located. No, this is not connected. Oh, that's horrible. That's so bad. You... Okay. <laughs> well, that's a disaster. 
Recycling station has to be next to here. Hmm. Okay, it's not a great location. There we go. We got the recycler station. What do we get? We now got a recycling beacon and a rock hopper. Rock hopper is an idea to make extra rocks. So that one, it'll shoot a rock over there, which is what we need in order to connect the networks. There we go. So now that's connected to the network. It's a little bit of a roundabout way, but we want basically everything connected to the same network here and that's connected great anything over here connected no nope. what's that oil probably maybe i don't know uh, i'll build this one here and oh no how is that not connected this i can't build it in here uh that okay so i have to build it all the way out here of course all these things can and will be removed eventually and then i need to get over to the other side i have that one and then i'm definitely gonna need one in the water like there to bridge this intersection great we still need something over on this side here it's too far away that is a good distance and then the final one Technically, you don't need because you don't need to go all the way around. Uh, that should connect. So now there's a connection all the way around, and I think we'll be able to get most of the stuff we want. Okay, so I want to start working on the animals. Let's see. The beach-dwelling reptile lives on an island where it can retreat to its shell. I don't have islands. That sucks. On an island, maybe the whole thing is an island. Oh, no. An island. But what if I don't spawn an island? Um, in range of at least 10 beach tiles. Okay, so what I think I need to do to get this is... Oh, I don't have this one to, dis to, to dig through in this mission. That's interesting. Hmm. Huh. That's really something that's weird, right? Like, what if... So the the fact that... Hmm. Um, what if... Maybe I can make a sandbank. I don't know. Do we think that's gonna work? Let's try it. If that counts as... Don't think it does. Um, does it count as beach? I don't know. Then get the salinator here. Uh, let's build one of these. Let's build it here. And then upgrade it to a... No, I don't think it counts. Scan here. Ah, oh, we found it. Ah, oh, perfect. So it did count a little bit as a... Woo, good. Hello, tortoise. This unusually shaped creature glides in the ocean near rivers, estuaries, and quarries. Okay. Um, I think I would river. Maybe we'll try this. It's a little bit. Yeah, it was good. A manta ray. And the colorful bird makes its home in lush forest cannabis beneath clear skies. So not under these. That means I probably need to take some of these out. Before we can even do that. Um, let's, take, let's take this up. And... That looks good. Good. And... So this will clean out a lot of stuff. Let's try let's try the scan here. If it doesn't like that. No, no, there's still still something. That's a still building. So it doesn't need a doesn't want a building, any buildings nearby. There. Still. Alright. Then I guess we take this one out. Clean out this area. 
So what happens now is that there'll be a little one going from here. It'll go all the way around because it's, well, not a particularly efficient way of doing it. And then we should be able to, when this one gets removed, and it will be removed together with, when I pick, make this recycling beacon, then it will take up everything, including this power pole at the end. Poof. And then we do a scan here. There we go. Perfect. Uh, this waiter combs for food among the sands of beaches and the mud of wetlands. So that's got to be sands and mud there. That has to be sort of in that proximity. What? Ten wetland tiles and range of beach. Ten wetlands and beach. Okay, so it has to be more... More wetlands. Oh, why do we? Why? Why does it say updated? Why does it say go go? Mud of wetlands. Seems to be something like this would be the right place. These 10 wetlands. Oh, these are not wetlands. Oh, shoot. Those are mangroves. Oh, uh, I don't think I converted this part over here to mangroves. Okay. But then I don't have a beach over here. Um, can I salinate a little bit? See, this is why I want to do this. There. Now I can scan this area. That should be fine. Why are they not wetlands? Okay. Um, let me figure out the hydroponics. That's a wetland. Maybe this area. It's difficult for me to see the difference between mangrove and wetlands. Hmm. So maybe I just need to make another wetlands area here. That's wetlands. Where can I make? Can I make? Which one is it? Uh, I need to make. Here. Let's make some wetlands. Because I need to make something. Uh, this cannot be. Oh, okay. I'll make this into wetlands. Good. That's wetlands. Nothing but wetlands. And then I need a little bit of salinator nearby. Uh, there, for example. Don't care that we use this. And then now I should be able to scan here. No! What are we not? Range of beach. That's a beach. Okay. I... Like that. How is that not successful? Is the beach not too much? I got a flamingo. Whew, those flamingos are tough. The aquatic predator lives in both dense coral and in waters of mangrove forests. Uh, that means I do not have the corals. So I am going to make one of these. Is there any of these that can be still be converted? Yeah, that one That one can be converted. Oops, that was weird. Uh, there. So I need it to be... This. Pick it up. And make it... There, right? Because this is mangrove. Let me see the difference between this is wetlands and this is mangrove. And we'll get this carried over so we can make the corals so we can scan. Dense crawl and in the waters of mangrove. I don't know why there are three things here. Shouldn't that be spreading? There we go. Got it. And temperature as well. And the last one. Large pelagic mammal swims in the deep ocean far from land Ugh. that's the closest yay we got a whale we got all things everything got it perfect now all we need to do is just clean up after ourselves which is uh, easier said than done and um, let's have a look at this this will not get us all of that in there so we are going to have to use this that will go in here and then i can use if I, if I take this one, then I'll break the connection. So I have to take the stuff that's furthest away first. So that one, for example. Take that out. This one. 
take that out. And then over here, if we look at these, none of them will reach that. So I have to clear that out by itself. This one being de deleted. Awesome. And then I can delete. Oh, that's already marked for deletion, isn't it? We can mark you for deletion. And we'll have another one going there. This, there's more than one working at the same time. I can also delete this island. Perfect. I don't think this one's going to go away. I can delete this island. And we can delete this part here. Just gradually take things out. And we can delete this one. Just kind of sort of streaming it backwards. That's taken out. This one is being taken out. Uh, this one's being taken out. This one should be taken out. Uh, I guess it's coming down there. That's being taken out. Poof. And we'll go move further in. Now I can't take this part because I have to delete it from this area first. That's good. This one's coming along. I like the fact that, we, that the way that we have to sort of clean things out backwards. Cleaning it in here. Uh, I do know that it's not the shortest path for sure. I don't know if I actually could make... Could I make one of these? No, I couldn't. They, they have to be in the water, but not in rivers and stuff. Um, but let's see. This can... Why can I not delete this? I can delete this. But not that one. Oh, it's already marked. Okay, never mind. Oof. Off you go. And then we can do that one. And we'll can take... Let's see. That's already marked. And that already has to be just one long chain of things just going down there, unfortunately. It's a little bit unfortunate that I can't bridge it across here. But that's just uh, an unfortunate way of the way of constructed it and so we're almost finished up on the cleaning we don't have anything else left on the map Nope, nothing uh, hidden, forgotten anywhere. And we can just clean this up. That is the last thing, 99%. We have every single mission completed. We have all the animals completed as well. And now we have just ready to lift off. And that completes the second mission. Right, so I think we have left a beautiful little tropical island. I really like the fact that in the middle we have the tropical forest. And we have some wetlands and mangroves and beaches along, well the beaches and mangroves thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed it i would like to continue this mission and i hope that you uh, want to keep watching it because i'm enjoying this nice little game it's very calm very relaxing and also just uh, it has a little bit of a challenge it's not super difficult but it's uh, it's it's a fun uh, it's a fun fun game and fun challenge and maybe on higher difficulty it'll be much more uh, difficult but at this point it's just uh, it's just very enjoyable let's see how much we got in percentage we got to 70, so I'm feeling that maybe we'll sort of have to come back or there's a dif more diff higher difficulty grade or something like that. We're 35% through the, on the restoration process and the next one will need to go into a portal region with tundra, lichen, uh, kelp forest and forest. More and more volcanic glacier. Sounds interesting, right? Well, check back uh, on the channel. Make sure you're subscribed and then we'll be checking out that mission as well. Thank you for watching. Until next time, take care and stay effective.